high priest gave us power Then we came and made us free What price now? I had a bottle right here in my dirty face. My two wet scars, two shows. How's it going folks? This is Wayne R back for another lesson and an absolutely classic today as always. I designed for life by the Manic Street Preachers. The first Manic song that I've done um, and probably one of their biggest anthems. Not an easy one to play um, so let's get to it. Okay so this song is in standard tuning and you know rather than strum it we're going to sort of pick through the verse. So I'll just go through the chords that we're going to be picking and what you're going to be doing with the picking pattern. So the first chord we want is a C major 7, so it's basically a bit like a three fingered bar chord. Uh, you'd have your first finger on the third fret on the A, the third finger on the fifth fret on the D, and the little finger tucked underneath on the fifth fret on the G, okay? And we pick from the A string, we go A, D, G, B, G, D, A. So just going down the strings and back up again. So that's basically the picking pattern we pretty much do on all the chords that we're playing. So that's your first chord. Uh, the second chord would be a D minor 9. So basically you'd have your third finger on the fifth fret on the A string. The first finger will be on the third fret on the D string. The little finger will be on the fifth fret on the G string. And we'd have the same, the same picking pattern. Okay. The third chord would be a G7, so we basically if you took a G major chord and took your little finger off, that would give you the, the chord that we want, the G7. But now we're picking the same pattern, but we're picking from the bottom E string, you know, down four strings and then up again. Okay, and then we want quite a difficult chord. So this, this chord will be an E flat major 7. So the second finger will go on the sixth fret on the A string. The first finger will go on the 5th fret on the D, uh, third finger 7th fret on the G string and the little finger will go on the 8th fret on the B string and we do the picking pattern now from the A string. You know. Okay, and the last chord we want in that sequence will be a, a D minor 7 flat 5. Now there's two ways you can do this, I tend to do it find it easier. My first finger will be on the 5th fret on the A string, 2nd finger 5th fret on the G string, 3rd finger 6th fret on the D string and little finger 6th fret on the B string and we, you know, or if you wanted to you could put, you know, a bar on, another way of looking at it, you could bar the 5th fret and do, you know, with your 2nd and 3rd finger you could do like an A7 shape, you know, and do it like that. Okay, so that's basically a verse chord, so Libraries gave us power and The second chord The only thing has made us free We've got the G7 ball And we have that E 
flat major seven, and then that last one that we did. Okay, so that's pretty much all your verse. At the end of the second verse, to show where I get it. You know, we, we do this little, we go into a D minor. So that would be from that chord, we sort of strum the chord, move that down to like, you know, two frets, and open A, and then we go to a D minor chord. So that would be. We don't talk. So I'm just sort of emphasizing, just doing down strokes, you know, on the, on a D minor sort of bar chord. And then we go to a G major bar chord. And I do this little run down where we go from the G to an F and then sort of an open E string at the end. So and then back into a D minor. We just wanna get drunk. The second time we go to an E minor at the end of that. And we a minor, A minor seven, just by taking your third finger off, and then we go to an F. And what I tend to do on this F is lift the bar off, so we're getting the open E and B string in throughout that. So. Okay, so that section again. So. do now we go to an the way I play this we go to an A minor bar chord and then it enables you to do this little this little run down you know with bar chords down the fretboard so we do an A minor we go to an A flat major bar chord to a G major to an F so we go in A minor Okay, that's pretty much all you need for the song. You go round again. The instrumental part, you know, with the you know all the strings that come in on the on the actual recording. We'll just be going around the verse chords again. And then the only difference is with the outro, it actually ends with sort of a drum outro. So, you, you know, and that will be the drum outro. So I hope you dug that, that's pretty much all you need. Okay, so thanks very much for watching. Hope you all dug that. Uh, absolutely brilliant song. Not an easy one to play and sing, you know. It's, I think anything that you're sort of picking and, you know, really thinking about what you're doing. But then again, it's a great song, you know, a great challenge. It's always good to, you know, look and get songs like this down, especially if you're sort of an intermediate player, you know. Uh, well, at the end of the day, it's just a fantastic song and it's, it's worth the effort, to be honest with you. Uh, so thanks very much for watching, thanks everyone who subscribed, I really really do appreciate it, you know, um, please spread the word because, you know, word of mouth is a powerful thing and, you know, please, you know, tell your friends and colleagues about me and, you know, if they're into guitar, because I've got loads and loads of lessons up if, you, if you've only just come across me, from Abba through to Metallica, uh, obviously loads of Oasis, the Smiths, the Stone Roses, which are probably three of my favourite bands, but loads of sort of obscure ones in between, you know, some great bands up there. Uh, any requests, you know, you could go over and like my page, which is Wayne R Guitar on Facebook. I urge you to do that anyway. You know, you can find out what I'm up to. But you could post message me as long as it's a nice message, a personal message. Um, you know, if you've got a request, or you could leave a comment in the video below or any of the other videos. Uh, I'm getting through one or two requests at the moment, so... 
if you have requested a song and yours hasn't come up yet, um, you know, please stay tuned because at some point this year or in the near future, it probably will do. I've just got a, a sort of a long list I'm getting through at the moment. So uh, until next time, take care, look after one another, and I'll catch you for another lesson very soon.